So this puppy is actually a foot roller. You can get these on Amazon, or if you actually had a regular fat foam roller, it would work not as good as this. You could also use a lacrosse ball, but what I'm teaching you is how to kind of like do some soft tissue work on your forearms. If, especially if you use your hands a lot for work, typing, or you're like a massage therapist, where you're doing a lot of like gripping things with your hands, this is perfect. But what I would put, do is put that guy down on the table, then I'm taking my thumb, instead of like thumbs up, dude, thumbs down, Boom. and then I'm trying to get on that fatty part of the arm right there, and then I can just roll back and forth. Like that is already crazy tight, but I'm just twisting my arm in as much as I can. Then usually this is a flared up side on elbow patients, but I can also thumbs up on this one, but kind of twist it in towards my belly a little bit and then get the other side, which is the flexor group of your hand. Um, but those are great ways to kind of pinpoint. You could also use a lacrosse ball and like get right in a spot that bothers you. And then I can bring my thumb towards me and away from me. So I'm going to and from that. You can feel like pretty intense if you grab a nasty spot. So same thing here too. I can go like flex it up towards me, flex it away. I kind of like work, people want a lot of parameters, like how many times should I do it? How many times per day? And I love that they're diligent students, but honestly, I kind of do this stuff to feel. So like, I'll kind of feel like, okay, that spot feels like it's getting softer as I do it, I'm done there. Or like, oh man, that, that spot needs a lot more attention. So it's not like, you're not gonna damage the tissue doing this too. So I mean, you can do this away. All you're doing is putting pressure on it to get stuff moving that isn't moving. So these guys are great options for self-care.